Why, hello everyone. Welcome back to Skyrim. Where we left off, we was inside this place over here that we found out of nowhere. But, we're going to be going to this side right here. See what's over here. Hello. Ice water jelly. Travel to the castle. Oh, that must be the DLC. No, I don't want to travel to the castle just yet. I'm almost certain that's the DLC. What I'm going to do is go back and start searching more over here. But let's make it day first. Cause this dog is really, really strong. There we are. There was a cave over there that we should try and explore and see what's in there. Just to see, you know, like what's on it. That makes sense. We could breathe on the water. Interesting. There's a boat. Why, sure, there's a boat. There's. What are y'all? Hi. What are you. Young man, none of that. Oh, hell no. Eat them. Eat them, my children. They have to learn to behave. Shall take their flesh, don't worry. That chunk of meat. Hi, there's two caves we could explore here. Let's go to this one first, then we'll go to the one above. Lower Street Fall Barrel. Let's see what we can find, guys. Do not forget, up next is Spooky Jump Scale Mansion. But we're going to do an endless mode. As y'all know, we're going to be going to 10,000 floors. But we're not going to do it in one go, of course. We're going to do it, you know, one at a time. Hopefully, there's saves and stuff in there. Because if it's not, then it's going to be quite difficult. All right, guys. Oh, what's that? Oh, God, young yeah, man. Let's see what's in here. As my children eat them. He has a diamond in his stomach. I could just imagine how he ate that one. Sorry if you hear me blowing my controller. It's a bit messed up. But that's not going to stop me from recording. Nope. Alright, that's pretty much it. Let's go inside that water place right here and see what we can find. I look very dark for a second there. I was like, what is that? But that's cool that we could breathe on the water. That means we could search a lot of things. I'll just take everything and sell everything that I don't need. Oh my god, we can't breathe on the water. I'll take it back. There's something up there. Okay, where's that hole at? I kind of lost the hole that I came from. Ah, there it is. 
Okay, so if I'm here, let's see what's over here on this side. Doesn't seem that much. Very well. There's another cave over there, as we saw, so I'll take it the other cave leads upwards. And this one is just the below one. Let's check what upstairs bring us. That way we could see, you know, what the dungeon would give us. We had to kind of parkour this. It's the only way I've really seen that it works. To climb up to places. There we go. Steep fall barrel. Take it all the most low one. This one's the legit one. So we have to be careful we don't fall. He's focused on that. We'll look around. I mean, he died. That's a shame. I guess that would teach you not to smash with the spider queen all the way. Actually, we're gonna have to switch to spider class since we're kind of in the frost area. Let's go with poison. Plus, poison seems like a better option. So you came all over here to find this and you die right there. That's a shame. Not a bad helmet, emerald, okay, can we use this? No, we already learned that. We'll just take it off. So far, we're doing absolutely excellent, though. We could definitely find a lot of things if we don't teleport. That's why I like that for the war I pull about no teleportation and stuff. Quite, you know, good. Because there's a lot of mysterious stuff you could find walking out here. Found a boat. Interesting. Offense heals. Okay. Okay. It's okay, guys. Let's see how they want to play it. It's cool. We're fine. First moment we come out, we get killed. It's quite peachy. But no worries. We'll handle this.
Alright, we're gonna have to attack him over here because the last time we went there we died. By those damn bastards. Not by those ones, but the guy inside. Get them, my minion! Eliminate them! That's the one that I killed. Him. Not this time. I'm gonna eat your essence. Alright, now. I'll take this in your life staff. Ah, let's see what's in here. So he must have been staying in here for a while, it seems. In this broken skooma. I'm getting high. Now we're gonna need some healing stuff, guys. Cause we legit dying from that jump. Something over there we could check and see what's over there. We should level up. Oh wait, those enemies. We should level up though, cause we haven't leveled up in a minute. Here we go. Where was that? This thing. We don't have no more. Anywho, let's see here. There's a house over here we could check. What's that? Let's see what's over there. Where is that? Cannot find the owl. Someone there. Oh, it's a hag. Go get him. It? No. I think there's more than that. There we go. Hang on, guys. Awesome.
there's three things we're gonna discover at the moment. There's this cave, there's this house, and there's another cave that we're gonna go up to. For now, let's see what's in this cave. Oh god. Attack your spider queen from this monstrosity. I can't tell you how many times I die with this thing. <laughs> they usually sneak up from behind you, that's why. Now, let's see what's in this cave. A head, how welcoming. To the hollows we go. Hello. <laughs> she just walks so slowly. Boss fight. <laughs> So the wrong queen, I'm the only spider queen that's there. You gave me a key. Hey. Ah! Oh shit. Bear with me for a moment. I'll come rescue you in a second. After I talk to you though. You see that, right? You hey, really don't want to mess with me if you betray me. Please, you can't leave me in here. If you let me out, I can show you where they hide their best treasure. Hurry, get me out of here! Now that we've got that out the way, I'll take everything you have, or your life. Actually, on second thought, I'll just kill you. Vampire! That's all you got! Uh! I think he messed with the wrong one. But I appreciate you telling me that they have loot in here. Wow, they kill a lot of things, huh? Young ladies, what kind of mischief things y'all been doing? He had a potion, but why did he die? I always wonder about like why you know like they did it for a reason why the game did it. Like he probably was torture and they gave him a potion a potion to you know they could torture him more, but he then took it so he just killed himself. I always try to analyze it more and more. There we are. We'll take the burn book too. You never know when we're going to slap someone in the face with it. So far, we're doing amazing progress, though, guys. My God. We discovered so many places already that is unreal. And not only that... Well, basically, we did discover a lot of places. I want to go up again because there was a house over there. And the more we go over there, the more stuff we're going to find. Uh, 
Hi, there was a house up here. Put my cup down, sorry about that. I want to see what the house is. I know I like, you know, going to caves and stuff, but I like going to houses too because you never know you find interesting people and stuff you could do. But, um. Oh. Okay. I actually haven't come across you in a while. What is it? I don't even know what y'all kill it, but it's fine. We'll go up. Now time for the parkour. Not only that, it looks like the house is over there up there too, so kinda was necessary to go up here like that. It's one thing that I do enjoy about Skyrim is that you could go through any place you want as long as you know how to maneuver around it. As most of y'all know, I know how to do that quite a bit. Even in Elder Scrolls Online. It's always good to move maneuver a little bit instead of going all the way around. There's always some shortcuts you could find. You just have to be patient. And as most of y'all know, once again, I'm not a very patient person. But I also don't like to be time consuming and stuff. This looks like a good spot. We could get to that rock right there. That'd be great. Almost there. There we go. There we go. Well, I think we went actually too far. Maybe. There we go. Now that we're in the right side, we could go up here and check these houses. There was actually a couple of houses, mine. And then a cave. Let's see what this is first. Oh, I'm good. I'm good with capacity. The house is still more up. Huh. It's like over this rock. Damn you! I will come back to that house. Let's check this cave first. What the hell is that? Maybe I could just move around.
I feel like we could definitely get up in this one, though. There's a lot of edges and stuff that I could climb on. There we go. Looky here. Looks like we got ourselves an uh, iron back high out. Hey, we heard about that. Now ain't this a surprise? I know y'all cold, so let me warm you up. As you can see. Oh, well, they didn't see a chance. What's the ban this sheet? I'll definitely take that. I know those goals for a bit. Actually, hold your okay, thanks. That's cool that we found the hideout, though. Not much else we there is in here, though. Let's go and check what that is, then go back to that cave in that giant light. If it is that, that's going to be quite a bit of a mile there. I believe it is that. They really do want me to parkour a lot, don't they? I think I'll be able to do it in this one though. No. This one, yeah. There we go. Well, hello there. Oh, I remember doing this. I remember I got in there, but either way, it was all locked either way, so I couldn't do nothing. I legit need a key for everything. It was a quest that you needed to do in here. So, eventually we'll return to this, trust me. We will. As for now, let's go back over here and check what's over here. But yeah, it's definitely a quest that you do go back to. Am I the only one who's very curious about that giant light? But as you know, before we go there, we have to search this cave. But I am quite curious about it. Wolf's Cave Camp. Let's see what it is. A pickaxe. So it will come in handy. An empty wine bottle. Huh. So it would definitely come in handy if it's right there telling you that they'll uh, pick up. My dude. You don't want to mess with me. Papuga! I 
tell him. So, whoever was in here, the bandits kind of took over and. Okay, what? Another place, huh? Oh, well, hello there, young lady. Ah, uh, young lady. Oh. You kind of flew. Grab this shovel too, because you never know something in there we need to shovel up. Well, we got the item. Hmm, why is this here? I am not parkouring that, hell no. I guess that's everything in here. Seems so. But anyway, let's go check that giant light up. I don't know what it is about. A giant light. That's my best bet to give it. Now, where is that giant light at? We like a hundred percent have to check what this is about. Lying in ruins. So much for the constancy of mortals, their crafts and their hearts. If they love me not, how can my love reach them? Replace the beacon. I believe I have something like that. There you go, young lady. Ah, uh, young lady. It is time for my splendor to return to Skyrim. But the token of my truth lies buried in the ruins of my once great temple, now tainted by a profane darkness skittering within. The necromancer Malkarin defiles my shrine with vile corruptions. We like me to eliminate him. Lost souls left in the Let me know, lady. Of this I'll do war it. to do his bidding. Worse still, he uses the power stored within my own token to fuel his foul deeds. I have brought you here, mortal, to be my champion. Really well. You will enter my temple, retrieve my artifact, and destroy the defiler. I'll do it. Of course you will. I have commanded it. Go now. The artifact must be reclaimed oh. and Malkarin destroyed. Very well, young lady. Malkarin has forced the door shut. But this is my temple, and it responds to my decree. I will send down a ray of light, guide this light through my temple, and its doors will open. Where is your temple at?
No worries, the spider queen shall be your aid. Open the door. Bust this motherfucker up. He dare mess with his holy beacon of light. This majestic creature, goddess, whatever the hell she is. We're no longer healing, so. Let's go with shock now. I have to admit, props to this person that made this mod for the spiders. They look absolutely amazing. And the fact that you hold them on your hand, too, that's quite cool. So she's pissy that he defied her cave for her temper with a whole bunch of dead corpses and stuff. But aren't you legit goddess? Can't you just smite he ass and that's it? Oh wait. I think only Zeus would do that. Oh my. But then again, who knows? A lot of dead bodies, I have to admit. Damn, that one had a lot of gold. Oh, aren't you interesting? <coughs> if you want to get past me, I mean, if you want to attack me, you have to get past them first. This legit what will happen if you fight a spider in real life. A spider queen. You know she's going to send out all her children to attack them. Here we go. But as she say herself, the door is open to her command. Not by he. Beacons of light in here. Good children. Come, your mother's please. The only reason why I call this, you know, this series the Spider Queen is because my character is a woman. I'm not gonna just say king or spider just because I'm a guy. My character is a woman and she deserves a oh, spider. Kill her. Kill him. Get on my children. Hang on, this one over here. I know you want to guide me, I get it, I understand, but I require loot. It's a necessary thing in my life. I wouldn't be the adventurer if I didn't want the loot. We're gonna take all of it. We greedy after all. Come on now. Yeah. 
Wait, what? Once again, guys, I do sorry. I am. I do apologize if you hear me, you know, blowing. It's because my controller is messed up and is it required to go in the garbage mode? What can you do? Honestly, I hate lock picking. Young man, none of that. None of that. I don't think so. I was about to say. Now we need to go over here, turn that one on. Is that almost fall? Here, catch! Okay. Now I have to go above, over, left, right, up, down. A lot of corrupted shades in here, man. Where is it? There we go. You're as you're as good as. I need a better weapon, my god, it sucks. Can never go wrong with the player ball. You're as good as dead! Die! Die! Burns me. Makes sense. I know, my bad, guys. Let's continue. So I was just in the headphone. Why hello there my dude. Time to die. Ooh. Oh me, that's two. That works. to die my dude this is not your home and they are coming here and thinking that you own the place I'll teach you it is dust 
The Defiler is defeated. Take Dawnbreaker from oh, its Oh, the pedestal. Dawnbreaker, awesome. Remember that. It looks all amazing, that's all. Watch what you can see here, guys. Give me the Dawnbreaker. is vanquished. Skyrim's dead shall remain at rest. This is as it should be. This is because of you. A new day is dawning, and you shall be its herald. Take the mighty Dawnbreaker, and with it purge corruption from the dark corners of the world. Wield it in my name, that my influence may grow. Young lady, you talking to a murder, a killer? I'll wield this mighty blade in your name. No worries, we won't do anything bad about it. May the light of certitude guide your efforts. Young lady, what's the dawn? Do you game yet? There we go. This sword will be using it. It's best as the ones that we got at the moment, anyway. Yeah. Anyway, let's quickly make a day. See what's down there. It's actually a lot of stuff, actually. Let's see what's over there first. So I got stuck. There we go. Very interesting. I want to see what you are. I'm sorry, but God. my fault. I need to see what it was. This man. Oh? You from this city oh, foul creature. Ah, oh, my leg. Ah, uh, guys. In all fairness, I know what you're all thinking. That wasn't my fault. <laughs> you 
Guys, that wasn't my fault, okay? Let me let me explain. I didn't saw my health. And I didn't know he was gonna beat the shit out of me. Okay. We still have the Dawn Breaker. Anyway, guys, that's for now. We'll have to end it there. Don't worry. We'll go back over there and retry that. That's for now. I hope each and every one of you have a lovely night or day, depending on y'all. And remember, guys, I'm somewhere in there. Trust me. I'll see y'all all next time. Peace.